need you to be my wingman. That's it. <clears throat> the, um, the girl that you'd be taking out isn't exactly the cream of the crop. You'd really be doing me a huge solid. That I cannot do. Why not? You expect me to go out with a disagreeable woman while you get all hot and bothered with the bell of the ball? So here's the deal. All right, I matched with an absolute Smokey the Bear on Tinder last night. But she has a friend in town from Nashville staying at her apartment this weekend, so she wanted to do like a little double date. So I hit up Bobby. He's getting ready to move to New York. He can't do it. I hit up his roommate, Lucas. Why'd you go to the homies, Bobby and Lucas? Why didn't you come to me first? I mean, to kick it real with you, the girls, like, definitely more their speed than yours. Well, let's be frank. After college ended, we had our fun. You didn't think much of our friendship. I can't remember the last time you invited me over for a cup of White Claw. I, I just thought that you had moved on to the next chapter of your life, Connor Dorleone. You found peace in your postgraduate years. You had tons of success with beautiful women in the Instagram direct messaging system. You figured out how to close on dating applications. You didn't need a friend like me. And now, you come to me and you say, Gonna Dorleone, give me justice. Well, you don't ask with respect. You don't even think to call me Thought Father. Instead, you come to my house on the day of my annual CEO's and office host party. And you ask me to go out with a soft five. I do not know. I ask you for justice. It's not justice. The girl you're going out with is the hard eight. So how should I pay you, Mr. Dorleone? Bryson! Bryson! If you had come to me in friendship, I'd be your wingman on this very day. And if by chance, a man like yourself, let's say, matches with a girl on a dating application like Bumble, and a situation came up in which your wingman would be required to fall on a grenade. I would fall on that grenade. And then you would seal the deal. Be right. Be Ronnie. Be monster. Be my homie. Thought father. Good. Someday, and that day may never come, I'll call upon you to do a service for me. Until then, take this justice. Me falling on the grenade for you, buddy, as a gift during my annual CEO's and office host party. Let's go rage, buddy. Grazie. All right, here's what I want to do. Um, get us a table for four at Dave & Buster's in the Valley. A uh, nice little conversation going at the tables. Maybe play some uh, ski ball because we're nice guys. We're not boys despite with this low life that hasn't hit me up since college, may say. So. Don't you have a girlfriend? You expect me 